Hey there guys, Cozy here and welcome back to another One Piece Treasure Cruise video and today we are going to be taking on the fake straw hat pirates who have come to town. Let's do it. Okay, so for this I am going to be running a double log Luffy team. Uh, the first Double Log Luffy team I did for this one, um, it was just the first team I ran. The first run I, I did on this, uh, I was like, okay, like it was going really well. And then I hit the, the boss stage, and he has one of those combo type things where you have to do so much um, hits before you can do damage. And uh, the fake Luffy, he has 20, and the team I was running... Uh, I think it barely covered 20 and I would only have one Luffy to hit now thankfully it only lasts four turns um, but it, it just won't do any damage so as you can see here with this team um, apart from log Luffy who only does uh, combo damage of four uh, we have Ashura Zoro who does nine hits and um, Avida Usopp and Ace all do six so that sort of gives me both log Luffy's for the final hits I mean it's a it's a really fun aisle to do it's not hard at all and they don't hit hard I mean you can take loads of hits look look at this one um, 150 off fake Robin and chopper and she silences your captain for three turns uh, if you have got the ability it will cut it down by however much your level is and I messed that up, but you can generally all of these characters one shot them uh, Regardless of what they're doing and a lot of stuff happens in this in terms of like what they do uh, Like the sort of you know the power up stuff they do I mean there's some stuff that I I can never remember what the hell it is and I will point them out and you guys can tell me what they are because I forget what they are and there's even one stage where like this totally new thing happens it's like you're electrocuted and it just messes up and I can't even figure out how to get the hit with it happening so the first one here um, I'm guessing that one's no cooldowns but it looks like it carries on um, we'll, we'll see that or well, we see Usopp it looks like he's frozen for three turns but it, it does still carry on and this perfect thing I have no idea but it doesn't seem to seem to affect you anyway it will when you do that though when you miss which is quite bad why are you missing I, d I love log Luffy team I I'm normally alright with log Luffy now let's see if it does go down on Usopp yeah, see it does so I don't really understand what that whole greyed out thing on Usopp is maybe it's if you've got his actual special ready you can't use it for three turns I'm gonna go ahead and guess that um, these little filler mobs they're not nothing to worry about either uh, it's actually quite good in this because you can get king pigs uh, the pigs before evolution are maxed and all the uh, the straw hat the fake straw hats you can only evolve the last character which and um, when ev evolved the picture shows all of the fake straw hats but the the actual image is of just Luffy fake Luffy um, yeah, that's the only one you can evolve, and his first level before evolution is 20, and I'm pretty sure it just maxes out of 50, so... But you can get skill ups, because there are skill books for Fake Luffy in this. Uh, the other ones are pretty useless. I mean, I think Connor said you can get 15,000 XP, so they're pretty much like three skill books wrapped into one. Um... They're, that's pretty much just chuck them into your units. There's no point really doing them, doing anything with them. You can just max them out later. Why do I keep missing? I've been doing these log lo lo Luffy's perfect lately. Maybe it's because of the team. I'm not sure. Again, what? All right, it makes me look really bad with the log Luffy team, but I I can generally do okay with log Luffy because I've done both of my um. A training for us with it but um yeah that's a, another little update i managed to get my ace 
Um, zero stamina, I'll done. I don't think I'm going to be able to do the other ones for a while yet. Uh, I don't think I'm good enough. But I got the ace boat. And I got it up six levels. Uh, that was in preparation for my legend ace. Who um, is just about max on his first evolution. When I evolve him, I'm going to chuck him one of those meats to max him out. And this is that stage I was talking about. With the uh, electric... Like electricity type thing running for it. I don't really know how it works, but let's let's see how it goes. It right. So see there. Now I, even if I try to hit, right, I'll try and hit a perfect with Usopp there, Luffy there. It just don't, whatever you seem to do, it just doesn't seem to work. And I can't figure out how to work around it. I just think you are screwed. Now there are sometimes when it will. I think it changes what character it affects. But it's not really going to make a difference. Yeah, see that it affected Ace there. and he, I'm sure it didn't on the first one. But it only lasted two turns. But I'm thinking, is this a new type of sort of defense power thing that the enemies are going to have? Like they're introducing that kind of stuff. If they are, I don't like it. And you're still missing. What's wrong with you? On the plus though, it is handy that these guys aren't hitting higher. Because I'm doing this run shocking maybe it's because of all the talking I'm doing I think I know why do you know what I always seem to have a bit of trouble hitting with Zoro I don't know why but Zoro's um, attack animation always seems to mess it I always seem to mess up on it so I think maybe I need to stop using Zoro for one of the third ones or to try and get the perfect on him now these guys, I'm going to see what uh, whether Luffy will take them all out, I'm not too sure. Other than that, like you can see they've got high cooldowns, but if Luffy takes them all out in one go, like he pretty much did there, apart from the green one, it just makes this one run a bit faster. It's actually the first time I'm using that Strong World Usopp. See look, Zoro, missed with Zoro, it is definitely Zoro that I'm having the trouble with. Which is weird because when I first started up, I used to use Ashura Zoro for like practically everything in my slasher team. And I think it's just where I don't really use slasher teams anymore. Literally just use Log Luffy for everything. Where possible, that is. If I have to use a slasher team, then I will. Um, so we will start with Zoro. And we'll try and work down this so there you can see we broke through and we one shot at him so it definitely helps if you've got those high combo characters just to break through that combo um, and you can take him out with Log Luffy in a one shot and I don't think we've got him we might have got a chest or something like that but yeah it's a it's a fun aisle it's a pr pretty similar to Fat Usopp a good little fun aisle to run go and have some fun with it I think Connor said you can get golden pound school books I've seen um, Strong World Luffy book drop and various other characters, mostly Straw Hat type characters, I'm pretty sure. But um, yeah, go have fun with it, guys. Hope you did enjoy the video. Please don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe, and I will see you in the next one. Thanks for watching, guys. Bye bye.